Hey, Ed Berzminski here from Chamber Marketing Partners. You know, the question keeps coming up in the chamber world, is print dead? Well, if you're in the daily newspaper industry, that is a challenged, uh, that's a challenging situation for print. You know, I, I get my daily information from uh, my phone, on the BBC app, from the, the CNN app, from the Fox News app, um, and that's where I consume my daily news. So yeah, if you're in the daily newspaper business, you've got some challenges. In the chamber world, though, print media does still remain strong. The Western Association of Chamber of Commerce Executives, WACE, in July 2017, uh, they did an opinion poll, and they show that 72% of chambers still produce a printed membership directory. In our opinion, we don't like to call them membership directories because just the connotation of membership directory is a little bit dated, but membership directories have been evolving into external communications pieces. Uh, like community guides, like economic profiles, like relocation guides, like visitors guides. It kind of depends upon the community. You know, you've heard the old adage, if you've seen one chamber, you've seen one chamber. Well, some chambers are more specific or have more of a bend towards community guides. Some have a lot of economic development activity going on and they want to talk about all of that economic development activity that's going on in that community. And some have a relocation that's happening. Um, and others have a lot of tourism and visitors coming through their market. So it really just depends on the chamber. Um, it, there's, uh, for instance, in Plano, Texas, uh, there's been a lot of corporate relocation going on in Plano. Uh, for instance, Toyota Motor Corporation has moved their corporate headquarters from Torrance, California to Plano, Texas. So Jamie Jolly over there smartly rebranded her publication from being a business directory and community guide to being her relocation guide and business directory. And she specifically takes that publication and mails it to uh, management at Toyota. And management at Toyota distributes, distributes it to their employees. Because as they're moving from California to Texas, that publication gives them an opportunity to see what Plano, Texas is all about. It's been very, very helpful, and it actually helped double the ad sales because now people are knowing that what eyeballs are seeing it. So real estate agents have started to advertise. Um, uh, senior services have started to advertise. A lot of home-oriented uh, businesses and real location-oriented businesses have started to advertise. So it really just kind of depends on your community. So to answer the question, is print dead? We at Chamber Marketing Partners resoundingly say no. Print in the chamber world remains very, very strong. That's my story and I'm sticking to it. I'm Ed from Chamber Marketing Partners, www.chambermarketingpartners.com.